You might recall first last week we told you about Charleston's former police chief, Ty Cunt, investigation coming to an end. Well, tonight the results are still not being made public. You see, back in the fall, Hunt was placed on administrative leave pending results of the investigation by the Professional Standards Division. Well, Hunt resigned as chief in August. During that controversy, a woman came forward saying that he made sexual advances toward her at his office in City Hall. Hunt later apologized for his actions. Councilwoman Shannon Snodgrass spoke at City Council tonight, asking why details of that investigation have not been released since Hunt is still employed in the police department, but now with a lower rank. In my opinion from the get-go, um, I think you have to be transparent. I think you have to be accountable for taxpayers' monies. Anybody that's watching this knows that if any of these allegations were true in any other organization, that would have been a terminable of offense. Now, the woman who said Hunt made sexual advances toward her, well, her name is Jenny Harless. She told counsel what she thought of Hunt, who is still on payroll. I'm deeply disappointed by the punishment given to the former chief and by the lack of support that I received from this administration. Now, we also asked Mayor Amy Goodwin for a comment on the issue, but she referred us to the new police chief right there, Scott Dempsey, why the city isn't being transparent, and here's what he told us. Come with this one, you can't comment on it. When, when the investigation was funded with tax dollars, that's what I think a lot of people are confused about. All right. Well, with personnel issues, it's it's directives from the HR. We 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 can't discuss the details. We can give some, like I mentioned, that he is under suspension, and I can mention that he was reduced in rank. But any any details, we just can't provide, unfortunately. Now add to the drama, a former Charleston officer filed a lawsuit against Ty Cunt and the department alleging he engaged in sexual activity with her while in a leadership role. We will continue to follow any updates for you as they happen.